Welcome to Serbia, a country in the southeast of Europe. Situated in the region where the east meets the west, where cultures cross and all kinds of battles often rage, Serbia offers to its visitors a variety of historical and cultural monuments and places of rare natural beauty. Back in the 12th century, Serbia was a country under the rule of the Nemanić dynasty that built famous monasteries and beautiful churches, leaving to the following generations valuable cultural heritage and a difficult task to save it from invaders and destruction. Serbian monasteries are scattered on the slopes of the Fruška Gora hills in the north, along the river valleys in the central part of the country, all the way to the plains of Kosovo and Metohi in the south. The monasteries are not just landmarks of Serbia, they are the life and soul of the Serbian people. These people of hard-working farmers, whose traditional poetry fascinated European writers and linguists of the 19th century, also gave to the world a couple of brilliant inventors, Mihailo Pupin and Nikola Tesla. In national parks, reservations and caves, true lovers of nature and wilderness can find plants and animals that do not live elsewhere in Europe. The capital of the country, Belgrade, is on the banks of the river Danube. In the past, the city was destroyed and rebuilt many times. Belgrade is a combination of Eastern passion and Western style. It's a metropolis with a warm heart that welcomes every guest. Belgrade has never had the elegance of some other European cities, but it charms with its vitality, the sense of humor and curiosity of its inhabitants. About 80 kilometers from Belgrade, surrounded by the cornfields, the city of Novi Sad is awaiting you to come to the conference Insight 2011. Once a part of the Austrian Empire and a cultural center of the Serbs, it is now the capital of the province of Vojvodina. The old streets of Novi Sad with the synagogue, Catholic, Orthodox and Protestant churches, witness of the mixture of cultures and religions in this region. These various influences have created the international spirit of the city which can be seen everywhere and tasted in the local cuisine. The fortress of Petrovaradin dominates the Danube and the city. Every summer the music festival exit takes place within its walls, attracting young people from all over the world. Novi Sad is also known for its theatre and film festivals. It is a university city as well, with a modern campus and thousands of students. In the vicinity of Novi Sad there are numerous medieval monasteries and the national park of Ruska Gora. The venue of Insight 2011 is in the very heart of Novi Sad, in the building of the Higher Education Technical School. We are looking forward to seeing you there.